Okay. I think this is working, which is complaining about the stream being unstable though, which I've not had before. God knows what that is. Let's just refresh that page and see if it's it bloody looks stable to me. Uh yeah, it looks fine. Bit rate's good. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with that. Sure. I think Facebook is okay as well. Probably. Um, I suppose I should probably check before I carry on. Oh, I can't use my phone because it's um it's my camera. Never mind. Right, okay. Let's uh, get started. Okay, so if I flip to here, hello, uh, hello, there we go, quite difficult to wave upside down, <clears throat> um, so let me just make sure I've only got the one microphone turned on, yeah, cool, lovely, right, so what we're going to do is we are going to Get my keyboard out of the way. Um, there's a little clue. We're going to do some programming of ROMs. The reason we're going to program some ROMs is so that we can put them in this thing. It's this thing I hear you ask. This is a Commodore CDTV. And. This is a machine, I think it was roughly 1994, 1993, I think. Um, might have been a couple of years earlier. Uh, Commodore had a fantastic idea, which was, let's take a normal Amiga A500, which by this point was getting on for a decade old, and let's put it in a box that people can put in their living rooms and um, do some multimedia stuff with it, which uh, is what the Amiga was good at. Um, if I switch to here, uh, oops, no, hold on. I have the wrong camera configured there. Let me just fix this. Uh, uh, I want to add a capture device. And I want to add an existing one. And I don't want that. Oh, hello. There we go. Hey. Um, but I want to get rid of this one. So let's remove that. Yep. And let's set this to be. Oh, why? Okay. Oh, okay. We're 4 3. We are not 16 9. Never mind. Okay. So. Here we go. So this is the Commodore CD TV. And we've got. You know, volume buttons, I think. Yep, play pause, record, I've no idea what records for, a bunch of buttons down there, and of course a CD drive. Um, this is a really early CD drive, so this isn't IDE or anything standard, this is this is entirely um, sort of bespoke. So, so bespoke in fact that, well, this bit wasn't bespoke to be fair, this bit is just old. Um, so. If you were to take a perfectly legal copy of Xenon 2 and try to jam it in there, that's not right, is it? Because this is so old, it uses these. So we have to pop here, we have to open that up, stick the CD inside the caddy, uh, in which is quite difficult to do the way I'm doing it. There we go. Stick it in the caddy. Shut the lid. And then that's what we used to have to do. Kids today with your MP4s. Anyway, I'll uh, I'll I'll get this turned on and um, and running so you can see what it does. Um, my camera's very wonky. Can't have that. 
uh, turned it the wrong way. Right, the CDTV is straight, the camera is crooked. Now both are straight, there we go. Just gonna switch back to Twitch quickly and just see if my stream is happy. It still says unstable, but I feel like it's fine. Is it fine? Oh, hello. Ah, ah, so did you manage to get an alert or something, Mo? Or, um, or did you just sense? Do you feel my presence on Twitch? No. Ah. Oh. But you found out. That's the good bit. Has anyone else found out? No one else has found out. That's fine. That's fine. I'll do this anyway. Um. Get that camera out of the way because I'm just going to knock it over and break it. Get this out of the way. And let's plug this in. With... Some homemade cables, nothing better than homemade cables, what can possibly go wrong? Uh, let's stick that in there and there. And so how did you find out I was streaming? Is that the right way? There we go. Right, power. Power lead. Roughly somewhere around there. And let's plug her in. Right, what I might do is just quickly switch back to the old shaky cam. And go to this. Right. So it really doesn't look like a VCR. The the clock isn't flashing, so it's not that VCR-ish, but you know. Right, so we'll turn this on. Bit of luck, you'll see something at the at the lower right. Hold on. Let's push this button. And probably toggle that off and on again. Oh, we could see nothing at all. Oh, did I just For sake properties? Add everything. But it was working earlier. <laughs> uh, I think. Ah, there we go. Hey, so that's um. If you if you were if you had bought one of these in the nineties and um, you got it home, you turned it on. That's the screen that you would get, and you would take your one of these, put that in there, and with a bit of luck, CD TV. I can't quite read that. I they they it didn't stand for compact disc television of course it stood for commodore bleh, commodore disc total vision or something equally ridiculous um madness there we go sound works as well probably too loud actually Let me turn that down Just realized you might be hearing that twice because I can hear it. Let me just turn the volume down on my. How do I turn the volume down on this thing? Oops. I've just managed to turn my monitor off. <laughs> I'll turn the volume down using the computer. There we go. Oh, I can still hear it. That's weird. Where's this coming from? Just a sec. I don't want to change the brightness. 
Well, bugger me, I've no idea where that music's coming from. It's weird. I literally have no idea what is playing the, that music here. Got everything turned down as far as I can tell. Never mind. Oh, I think I know. Yes, of course. It's the sound from my own damn stream, isn't it? Oh no, I've got that muted. Weird. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Okay. So yeah, let's just have a little look at that full screen because uh, we can. Uh, nope. Nope. There. There we go. Nice. So this is a CBTV that works. Now, there's a little trick on this machine. I'll turn it off. Hit the biscuit off. And so we've seen what the CBTV would normally do. Uh, if I switch to this, you can see I've got some random crap hanging out the back here. Um, the CBTV doesn't have standard mouse and joystick ports like the Amiga does. It has some weird custom controller things. So I've put in an add-on to give regular DV9 mouse and joystick connectors. There's also this little guy. And what this will let us do is if I oh, let's just bring that up. I'll turn him off. Flip that switch, then turn it back on again. That CDTV stuff's disappeared, and what we're left with is the standard Amiga A500 with a kickstart screen. So if I were to fit a hard drive or anything like that to this, or excuse me, or uh, if I had an external floppy drive, I could then just stick in any old Amiga floppy disk and off you go. Um, it would just behave exactly like a, an A500. Um, now, if you're an Amiga user from back in the day, you'll be wondering how comes I've got Workbench um, Kickstart, sorry, three point something, because that's 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 not the Kickstart screen that a, a standard A500 would ordinarily have. Um, that would be the, the white screen with the big floppy disk. Um, and I will get to that after we've taken the lid off. So let's do that now. Pull that out, pull that out. I'm gonna knock, I'm gonna destroy this camera at some point. It will get knocked off the desk. Or my keyboard, which I nearly did the other day. Um, I emptied an entire bottle of cocoa grip, which was nice. Oh, oh, lost audio stream is breaking up a bit. Mm -hmm. I think this is the fault of, um, I think this is the fault of Restream, the service I'm using to, to Restream to several places. Uh, you absolutely may share it um, if it's stable enough to watch. Um, see, everything's green for me. Um, but it is not green for either Twitch or Facebook. So I think I because I, I stream to um I stream to a company called Restream and then they then share it out to Facebook and um and Twitch. Um so I think the problem might be on their side. Um Let me know, Stephanie, if it's if it's too bad to continue, and um, I can I can try something. I'm not quite sure what. Um, yeah, everything looks green. I haven't dropped any frames. Hmm. Could be a bit right. Let me try refreshing this. Right. I'm just gonna watch back my watch back my own stream in a sec. 
That looks okay. Hmm. Yeah, give me a shout, Stephanie, if uh, if that is actually what I'll do is I'll just reply in here as well. Um, I'm just going to watch back my watch back my own stream and say that looks okay. Hmm. The back. Back. Yeah, give me a shout, Stephanie, if uh, if that is actually what I'll do. I mean, it's it's back. Is it working? Are we good? I'll carry on for the moment yeah, and uh, I'll try and keep an eye on the chat so I can see if it's, uh, I mean, it's, it's behaving it's itself. Is it working? Are we good? Um, let me just rearrange some windows. God, I've got too many windows and not enough screens. First of all, let's switch to this. All right, I'll just carry on for the moment. Okay. And, uh, I'll try and keep an eye on the chat so I can see if it's, uh, I mean, it's behaving itself. Is it working? Are we good? Um, let me just rearrange. Power lead out of the way. And. Got too many windows and not enough screens. First of all, it's really it's annoying because everything looks absolutely fine here for some reason. I'll carry on for a moment. Okay. Yeah, I can. I can see myself. Yeah. We shall see. Power lead out of the way. Of course, when no one watches, when I'm streaming and there's absolutely nobody paying any attention at all, it's flawless. Or is it? Maybe it isn't, and there's just no one there to tell me. Ooh. Of course, when no one watches, when I'm streaming and there's absolutely pretty choppy, is it? Attention at all. It's flawless. Okay. I think what I will do is. I will. Stop the stream, and I think I'll stream directly to Facebook rather than um, sharing it to Twitch. Because if I check my chat, I don't think there's anyone in there apart from bots on Twitch. So I think this is restream that are having a problem. So I will go directly to Facebook instead. So I will stop this, and I'll be back. Think there's anyone in there? The same drive. It's fantastic, isn't it? it? I love this. I love this so much. It's um, my one of my favourite things. And you can tell I like it because everything is still in exactly the right place. If uh, <laughs> if it displeased me, it, this would all be messed up probably. But um, yeah, the iFixit, something or other. Um, it's good stuff. Right, I'll say goodbye and I'll be back in a sec. Um, it'll be on a different uh, different thing on my feed, but it'll be on Facebook. Um, if anyone is watching on Twitch, go over to Facebook and 